all right guys welcome back so last night i let ryan and ruby which for those of you that don't know my son and my daughter i let them play this game for like 15 minutes 10 minutes even i literally had to drag them out of the room <laughs> to go to bed even a four and a six year old know that this is a masterpiece okay they were like addicted like just running around in the world and like i i taught them how to tame one of the mounts and they were going crazy They're like oh my god it was um it was really 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 cool to see that but also a nightmare because they wouldn't let it go but anyways welcome back i just thought i'd share that <laughs> welcome back to another episode of horizon forbidden west so i think today if my memory serves me right i think today we are headed into the secret bunker dude i'm so excited this game just, just just keeps pulling me in, man. It is a little bit longer than I anticipated. I know I've went into it knowing that it was going to be 25 plus hours long. But um, there's a lot of traveling, a lot of exploring that... Man, I've, I've got Elden Ring coming out soon that I really want to try out. I know those games are extremely difficult. And um, this game is very long, like so I'm I trying to finish to door. the main story for you guys. And this seems to be... There's a lot of equipment in here. Ooh. Gaia, what was all this for? This room was designed for management of the facility's vast seed banks. From here, control center operatives would have monitored new crop rotations into the automated farmlands, now known as Plainsong. I see. Oh, cool. According to this console, there are still thousands of plant samples stored deep below the facility. I could ask Gaia about them the next time I talk to her. Dude, that's so cool. Caterpillars and chrysalises. I've been tackling the design of the Ag Lab. Place is gonna have a lot of seed stock to work with. My favorite? Sample 626. Calotropis gigantea. The crown flower. We used to have one in our backyard. Butterflies always fluttering around. Looking in that power Every morning, must have August would run out there holograms. to check under the leaves. See if any caterpillars turned into chrysalises. Now, I'd like to imagine that the future will be filled with them. So, These are all like the rooms that a guy has been Gaia, opening. What's this room? This would have been an access point for advanced training modules on terraforming operations. And while those modules were deleted when the Apollo database was destroyed, I was able to repurpose the equipment to store the data you have acquired in your travels. Now, today's quest is called Pharaoh's Tomb, in which we have to go and recover an Omega clearance from Thebes. Ted Pharaoh's private bunker. Aloy must journey across the bay to the ancient ruins of San Francisco. So we're now headed to the first area of this quest, just to find Alva. And again, we're going to be heading towards the uh, Forbidden Forest area, as well as possibly some beachy areas, as we're going to San Francisco to find the bunker. And we don't have a mountain right now, so there's going to be some walking and running here, but it's okay. This is all brand new territory for us as well. And I just, honestly, I cannot get enough of this game, dude. Like, this world that they've created. Jesus Christ, bro. It is so beautiful. It is so Anything stinking beautiful. Right? Okay, so I want to say we should probably go up through here. There's going to be some, uh... Medicine that I'm going to pick up along the way here. I will be editing some of this. I don't want to be running for 25 minutes either. I mean, I'm going to do it regardless. <laughs> but I don't know if you guys are interested in 25 minutes of running. So. Look at this. We just found a new settlement here. Ooh. And we found a brand new campfire. Lowlands Path. Enter. You. Ally of the Tanakh. What's up, guys? Everything good? Nice. Let's see if this hunter has something interesting. An adhesive warrior bow. Whoa. Damn. Wow. 
Wow. Sunwing circulator. Oh, that's from that freaking bird. Those birds are insanely tough. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Fine, fine. Open your stash. I'm gonna restock real quick. And uh, I, I will be on my way. Thank you guys. It was it was a pleasure. Wait, can I, can I climb up there? Of course I can. They're just fighting each other. I don't know what's going on. They're probably sparring. I'm gonna go up here. This looks interesting. Nice. Find some my stash later. Okay, so we're gonna jump this way. Or not? We're gonna repel. We've got a zip line. Yo, this is crazy. Dude, what the heck? Okay, so now we're gonna do this. Now we're gonna glide. Man, this is so freaking beautiful, dude. It's like up early in the morning, so I'm, I'm waking up right now and it's just vibing out, man. Find Alba. She's freaking far away. I think we're arriving here at Fall's Edge now. And actually, I thought we we're gonna have to go and find Alva first. But it turns out that she's much, much further away in Fall's Edge. So we're gonna have to do this one first. This is interesting. Bro, look, I don't know who the level designers are for this game, but holy crap. This is insane, dude. This is crazy. Your courage served you, and hey, it's Akaro's champion. This must be Fall's Edge. Tala said I could resupply here, then head for the Quinn Ferry. Careful now. Heard you dropped part of the throne on Regala. Not bad. Yeah, that's right. You heard right. That's absolutely right. Okay, so we arrived here, but there's really nothing going on here. This is only good for like, uh, I guess, stocking up and possibly uh, acquiring anything we need to acquire, which is totally fine. Let me see. Let me see what these guys have here. We have an herbalist there. We have uh, got to be some secret stashes around here. We've got a hunter as well, which is nice. We've got a workbench. Let's see. Seeker hunter bow. Ooh. See, man, a lot of these things require a sunwing circulator. There's a sunwing right here. Oh shit. Very nice. Hit him with the silent strike. No, don't don't come here. Oh god. Oh god. Hey yo. Okay, okay. Okay. Hey, I got my bristle back. My bristle back can do some things, you know? Okay, hold on. Maybe not enough. All right, hold on. All right, that's it. You guys are done for. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Is it dead? Yes. Someone cut uh, circulator. I got it. I'm gonna revive my. Son of a bitch. Put another trap right here. Very nice. You guys ain't that bad. <laughs> you ain't that bad, huh? Little bastards. Unbelievable, man. Alrighty. We have arrived. With the necessary goods. Um, elemental no, not that. Oh, was this one? Right? Yes. So this one has. That's pretty good, dude. That's actually pretty good. I'm gonna buy that shit. Buy and equipped. Hmm. I'm gonna put that there. You need that, I'm sure. The Seeker Hunter Bow. So now we have the Seeker Hunter Bow. 
It's 36, 85, 40. Wow. Wow. That is incredible. Okay. We're somewhere different now. Oh, look at this. We've got new hunters here and everything. Wow. Okay, hold on. We've got melee pit. We've got a campfire. Let me grab that campfire. Oh, this is nuts, man. It's huge here. Perfect. All right, so now we can travel here. Easy. Now, hold on. We have up here. That's where we go to find Alva. That way. Melee pit. Oh, look at this. We've got, uh, we've got a stitcher right here. Jump top. Oh, sweet. And where's, where's the stitcher at? Here we go. You're the stitcher? You must be here for my arm, yes? Yes, I can work with this. What are you doing? Envisioning the best armor you'll ever own, child. Worthy of Hikaru's champion. I didn't ask you to make me anything. But I offered nonetheless. You should be honored. Any soldier worth their marks wears armor of my making, even Chief Hikaru. Get me the right resources, and I'll craft something that'll make you the envy of all three clans. Really? Yo, what the f Oh, God. This man is lit. Look at this shit. Thunder Jaw Circulator. Man, this is crazy. This is really cool, though. I'm going to go for this one. And then I'm also going to go for this one. We're going to need it. That is fucking awesome. Very nice. Very, very, My very offer nice. still stands. A soldier like you should only wear the best armor. And that's what you'll get at Oka's Forge. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get that armor, dude. I'm gonna get that armor. 100 percent I wanted to start off with um Go to inventory. I'm gonna go with this for now. This armor is sick as fuck. <laughs> Let's go. Oh man. Good to see you. Let me see here. Hold on. There's another hunter here, isn't there? We walk Oh, and there's a chest. Bench down there. And the hunters right here. Wow, man! Look at this. More weapons. Sun-touched hunter bow. So I can replace this for the fire one that I have. Ooh, that one's nice. Yikes! There's so many weapons here, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna go and get this one. I'm gonna get this one and I'm gonna equip it for this and then I don't think I can buy the other one now or can I see I wanted to get this one after but that's fine so an ammo that deals plasma damage is now available in your inventory use to focus to scan enemies and see if they're weak to plasma hitting them with plasma will build up the plasma blast state which creates a time detonation continue to damage target before the time expires to build up a more powerful explosion two glow blast canisters with glow arrows to detonate them and trigger a large elemental explosion it's too bad it's nighttime dude i really wanted to see this during the day is it down there it is down there yikes wow dude Oh, this is 
Beautiful. That's strange. No. Nothing's stopping me from taking the boat. <laughs> That's true. Examine the boat. Oh, shit. It's like a Spinosaurus or something. <laughs> That's a Spinos Slaughter Spy. That's a Spinosaurus. Basically what that is. Shit. But we're actually going to a different area in the world. Like we're leap. Whoa, that is crazy. Aloy, you're crazy, girl. You some cray cray, Janae Nay. You never even handled a boat in your life. What are you doing? That is beautiful. Wow. Dude, I would be so freaking scared. I mean, yeah, we have machines, but there's still real life sharks down there, okay? Sharks have survived through almost every single extinction. Oh, it's pushing me south. There's no choice but to head for that beach. Wow. This is so freaking cool. Look at our weapon wheel now. <laughs> that shit is stacked. <laughs> we got so many options of weapons. Oh, uh, y'all machines are fucked. That's all I'm saying, man. We got this campfire. You never know. So we are headed this way. Man, this is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. The fuck, man. For the next fight, so these are the ruins of San Francisco. The entire city of crumbling towers. And somewhere buried out here is Thebes. I hope Alva and the Quim can help me find it. What the hell, bro? Alright, so you know what that calls for. Alright. Sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. This outfit is more, uh, much more, uh, for stealth. Dude, this is insane. Wow, bro. This is so beautiful. Look at the deep sand. <gasps> you guys know me and, 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 and the beach vibes, bro. <laughs> this is insane, dude. Oh, we've got a... Got a pelican! That just destroyed a pelican! <laughs> Sorry. That was so evil. What the hell was that? Man, this is fucking beautiful here. I'm in love. I'm honestly in love. Dear Lord, man, this is insane. Red Eye Watcher. Stop, man. Damn it. Oh, I saw me. That's just great. You guys.
guys are gonna fall for that trap. You know that, right? You're gonna fall for that trap. No, you're not. Mother. He literally. He literally. He literally shot my trap. These guys are incredible. No, you guys are absolutely incredible. But it's fine. I'll take you out one at a time then. I don't even think I need a trap to kill you guys. You guys are a disgrace. You guys are a disgrace. I thought you guys would be more, I don't know, durable, stronger. But you're just a joke. You're not worth my traps. I'm sorry, you're not. Legacy's landfall. And we've got a... Oh, we can't go through here. Dude, this is crazy beautiful, man. This is like... This world just keeps on amazing me. Honestly, like... I have no words. Except like, like, like. I don't know what to say. This isn't... This is some next level. This is a real, real next-gen game, dude. Let's not forget, this is open world. This is not like a linear game or anything like that. This is open world, you know what I mean? So. Must have on its head. Must be a That's, oh God, that's fine. I just needed to override this, this mount. Get out of here. Wow, dude. Oh, is that a settlement over there? It must be the entrance to Lily. Is that her? The living ancestor. The diviner <laughs> wasn't lying. This is Landfall, right? I'm looking for Alba. Overseer Bohai ordered us to invite you before him should you approach. Please, come with me. Go. Let him know we're coming. We're somewhat of a big deal, as you can see. It's her! The Diviner was right. <laughs> Overseer Bohai, a stranger just walked through the gate. I knew Alva would not dare lie. You do look like Sobek. Is Alva here? I need to talk to her. I will consider your request once it is determined what you are. A living ancestor as Alva believes, or a threat lurking in such a guise. I am no threat, okay? Huh? Back on the mainland, your soldiers fired on me without warning. So you say, infidel. None of those you engaged survived to bear witness. I held off on your squad when... Hmm. Oh, so he's not even the, uh, the elite there. Oh, shit. May I present our honored CO? So, here she is, our great mystery. Well, Bohai, what have you divined? What is she? A mystery indeed, my CEO. How can she appear as Sobek, and yet know nothing of our ways? Are we to believe that a living ancestor was born to this wretched land, an ocean apart from the realm of the Chosen? And if so, to what end? I cannot answer. Only she can. 
But I warn you, no falsehood will satisfy us. Now speak. Why are you here? What is your purpose? I'm looking for a place called Thebes. And what do you seek there? Alva told me a little bit about what you're after. I guess you could say I want what you want. A way to heal the world. As I suspected. Tell her. We found Thebes, the final <laughs> resting place of Ted Pharaoh's secrets. It isn't far, but the way is closed to us. Machine attacks have cut us off from the site. Diviner Alva is there, along with a complement of diggers and soldiers. Is she all right? Our scouts tell us that a machine has our people pinned behind their defenses, but they're holding out. Machines, huh? I can help with that. Alva told us that you are indeed formidable. But I have a few questions first. We will answer what we can. It's crazy. These people are like living separately, <laughs> like in a completely deserted, far away island, if you will, because they're so far from where we're at, right? So you found Thebes. How? The ancestors revealed it to us not long after we made landfall, almost a year ago. Through a scrap of ancient data discovered by Alva and verified by myself. It contained details about the construction of a great underground palace. Where exactly? Close. Beneath the Great Pyramid in the ruins beyond. Figures. Ted loves his pyramids. Have you been inside? Uh, no. That has been a problem, one of many. Hmm. And we will solve them all in time. Getting back to the site is the one at hand. I hope you're as effective against machines as Diviner Alva suggested. What exactly are you looking for inside Thebes? I thought Alva brought back the data you needed. We risked much to cross the ocean. Therefore, we must unearth every possible link to the legacy while we are here, especially one as important as Thebes. We will not sail back until I have plundered its secrets. So, Alva reports to you. I was chosen by my colleagues on the Board of Overseers to supervise data retrieval on this expedition, yes. And you're in charge of the expedition. He is far more than that. You are addressing the cousin of the Emperor of the Quinn. Heir to the vast holdings of the Great Delta, the first CO in five generations. All she needs to understand is that I am the authority here. And my will is to attain the secrets of Thebes. Mine too. We're in luck. You crossed the ocean on these ships? Couldn't have been easy. Greatness is never easy. <laughs> what Indeed. Idiot. It took seven years just to build the flotilla. This expedition is the most important undertaking of our generation. A quest for knowledge across the gaping sea with nothing less than the fate of our tribe at stake. And none of it would have been possible without the will of the CO. The voyage was difficult. The wilds here hmm. even more so. Our sailors and soldiers have suffered much. I know that. But all for the glory of the Quen. Good to know. These guys are a bunch of losers. <laughs> you could tell, they're like, 
I'm a reincarnation of Elizabeth. I'm sorry. I'm much more important than you are. What kind of so. machine has your people pinned down near Thebes? A Thunderjaw. We've dealt with them before, but this one is... Tougher, stronger, and it has black armor? Yes. How did you know? <sighs> Doesn't matter. Won't be easy, but I can take it down. Then destiny shines upon us, as I knew it would. A living ancestor now walks among us, and she will help me attain the secrets of Thebes. Resupply here if you must. Then on to Thebes at the base of the pyramid in the ruins. Mm. We will follow when our scouts confirm you've cleared the way. This is by far my favorite place in the game so far. There is a beach. I'm in there like swimwear, baby. Let's go. Oh, shit. Dude, this is awesome. I'm like aroused right now. <laughs> I love this. Oh, the ocean. God, this is so freaking beautiful, man. Unbelievable. Ancestors Prime. Okay, hold on. Let me see. If, let me get. Did I? Let me interact with this campfire just in case. Oh, look at this. We have also a... Wow. Okay. So, knock the dragon. Oh, some of these we already had before. But they're... Well, we've seen before, but these are better uh, rarities. No, I trust in the words that guide us. I only wish us to succeed in our mission here. Then I had better not hear of any this might be the game of the year, dude. Follow your orders. This is top, top contender for game of the year right now. This is, this is going to be a hard game to beat. Smell There's this. just too much and in it. This is crazy. All right, so let me grab this here. What just? Thebes. Go to Thebes. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to do this, but we'll try. Okay, off to the big pyramid to fight the Thunderjaw. Those thunder jaws are always fucking crazy. A drone must be Ooh. part of Cyclops. Another drone. If I can get its data. I can reconnect it with the dome back at the base. But how to get up there? All right, we're almost here.
close to this guy. I'm like all up in his face. I'm about to kiss this man. So I'm gonna do a blast trap here. He's gonna come right into my trap. That was satisfying. That's the hardest part. Let's do that. Stuff for the stash. Y'all better start bowing down to me right now, I swear. I'm just saying. I better get on your knees and start kissing my toes. And feed me some uh ooh, lobster. Feed me some uh some grapes while you're at it, okay? 
I'm a big fan of grapes. Seedless, preferably. Oh, sick. That was pretty sick. You right, killed that machine. Of course you I did. Sent me. I need to speak to Alva. By all means, then. Open the gates. Mm -hmm. Look at her there. <laughs> Hold on, Alva. Hey, just save. Just in case. Over here. Alva. I'm glad you're okay. Oh, you got rid of that machine. But what are you doing here? There's something inside Thebes that I need. I went to Landfall. I met your CEO. We came to an agreement. Kind of. And you're going to help us get in? I guess so. The whole thing was a little tense. There's something off about that guy. And I don't understand what he wants from Thebes. I thought we found the data that your people needed back on the mainland. That data will take us years to sift through. The CEO wants faster results. Aloy, you have to be careful. He's... There they are. The legacy tells us that Elizabeth Sobek helped the ancestors cast aside all obstacles. And so it has been today. You have been true to your word. I'm pleased. Thebes awaits us below. Shall we? Hmm. Quite an excavation. Much of this was flooded. We had to pump a great deal of water out. Jesus. What if one of them is like a zenith and we don't know, right? That'd be crazy. Behold, the door to Thebes. You're gonna freak out when a I open it. A door like no other. Wow. Well, you're right about that. It's designed to open for only one man. Hmm. Ted Pharaoh. But the legacy tells us that he worked closely with Sobek. He trusted her. Surely she can open the door, and so surely can you. Not gonna happen. At least not from this side. You said she was a living ancestor with Sobek's eternal essence. Uh, if I may, Pharaoh, great as he was, did not build his palace alone. We know this from scraps of data we found. The ones that pointed to this location. And we found evidence of passages below. Maybe they were built to aid construction. Or for servants. We can't reach them. The way is flooded and they're too far underwater, but... I... Yeah. I can reach them. There might be another way in down there. You see? With Sobek, there is always a way. Then do what you must to get us inside. I'm surprised there's not like any uh, loot on this section of the world. At 
least not down here. I would, I would assume that the, the devs would put like some really cool loot down here, you know? Maybe some secret loot or something. This is one hell of a place. The oxygen tank that we got in Las Vegas is coming handy. Really, really much handy. Alright, so... Now I'm a little long. Oh, I gotta wait for that to stop. Please don't turn on. Okay. Here we go. On this way, maybe? Bro, this is crazy, man. God, I'm stuck. This game has been reminding me of like Zelda in a sense where like you have all these sorts of temples, like water temple and all that shit. Oh wow, they had a nice Looks little like gym here. Exercise room? Call the gym, okay. These guys had to stay fit. Here I am again. Hiding in the gym. Hmm. Writing to stay sane in this crazy place. I can't believe Gregory's dead. Our so-called spiritual leader was fine yesterday and then suddenly passed away in his sleep. And no one will talk to me about it. They treat me like a child, whispering behind my back, as if I can't cope with death, even after the end of the world. So Ted had other people in here with him. This place is massive. Oh, look at all the loot. Nice. Or, well, actually, never mind. That was a. Uh, it's pretty big too. was one of these audio logs but it was a purple there's nothing normal about a scientist his daughter a guru and well let's face it a harem living through the end times in the trillionaires underground survival bunker but now that kagori's gone i'm worried things will get even weirder he helped keep ted stable for a couple of years hmm. sort of without him who knows and we don't even understand what happened to him Girl's right. I can learn all about Ted. Let me go here. Wait, can I open this door? Look at this place. Fuck. Alright. Pretty fancy for a survival bunker. Alright, I don't want to go there just yet. I wanna. I want to explore all of the there is to explore here first. I know everyone's reeling after Grigori's uh, untimely demise. He was a deeply spiritual man who wasn't afraid to. Yeah, something tells me it didn't turn out that way. No, no, hold on. I know everyone's reeling after Grigori's uh, untimely demise. 
He was a deeply spiritual man who wasn't afraid to rip back the curtain and gaze where few men dare. I've asked Dr. Sumtau to, you know, what happened to him. I'm sure he had some kind of condition or something. The main point is that while we certainly miss him, we will go on. Everything's gonna be okay. Gregory's journal. Did I tell Ted what he needed to hear or only what he wanted to hear? Did I want to lead him to salvation or was I simply seeking my own? I invited him to consider his being in a, in a universe bereft of the trappings of techno nihilism. But did he instead annihilate his own past along with the rest of the world? Oh God, what have I done? This is Ted's room. I mean, Gregory's room. So we're going to go back up top now. Oh my door. god. The door. Let's if I can open it from the inside. Oh yeah, these guys are on the other side. <laughs> I'm not going to open up shit. I'm going to stay here. And uh, yeah. Hold on. Let me, in let me investigate some of the logs here first. Most of Ted's women repulse me, okay? They're like mm. contestants on a housewife sim preening for the hubby's attention. But Brianna, the hollow singer, she's different. She's always been nice to me. Mm. And I love her voice, which has been conspicuously silent since Grigori died. She doesn't speculate or gossip like the others. She knows something. I can tell. And I'm gonna find out what it is. Hmm. This is interesting, bro. This is cool. It's like a pyramid, an Egyptian pyramid. It's cool. Ah, good. An emergency exit function. Are they on the other side? Emergency exit. No, they're not. Oh, this is a different door. It's not the same door. Oh, it is. The door is open. Damn, we were. Destiny went. is upon us. I knew you could do it. What's going on? The CO is preparing to enter Thebes. What a fucking tool. Oh, why are you dressed like Ted Farrow? I am Pharaoh, renewed. My essence is the same as his. Across the years, across the generations, his soul is my soul. His will is my will. We are sundered in only one way. I need his final testament, his deepest secrets. And now that the door is open, those secrets are within my grasp. When I have them, I will be complete as he was i will have everything i need to save our homeland and as pharaoh did the world okay i think there's some confusion here about who pharaoh really was no one knows better than i who he was who he is me the renewer greatest of the ancestors the man who saved the world. And you. You understand, Sobek. You are her. Pharaoh's harbinger. His assistant. Come. We will descend into Thebes together. As it should be. Bring her the raiment. Raiment? As he is Pharaoh, you are Sobek. For an occasion, this momentous, shouldn't you wear proper business attire? What the fuck? <laughs> Whoa. No, 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 no. No, I am not wearing that. No way. You will wear the proper attire to mark this moment. Or what? It is said Sobek valued life above all else. Is this true? Fine. I'll wear your raiment. <laughs> oh my god. 
god. <laughs> Just look like a regular Joe Schmo. Excellent. Shall we proceed? I'm surprised he's letting everyone in. You look so different. Look at this tire. place. The grandeur. Pharaoh's domain. Somewhere in here, Pharaoh left his secrets. Looks like the emergency them. exit function and unlocked this door, too. Perhaps we should leave guard behind to cover our exit. Indeed. Now let it be done. Whoa. Holy. Yo. I think this way might lead down. Excellent. Remember every detail of his bohai for posterity. It will be as Quite a palace Pharaoh built for himself. No less than he deserved. Of course. Grand. This guy's fucking delusional. Pharaoh had a foot bath in here. I've always wanted to go. There will be no further discussion of your feet, Bohai. <laughs> Brianna told me that Gregory hacked into restricted files and found out something awful. That Ted murdered important people who worked on Zero Dawn. Did Ted punish Gregory? Kill him for discovering what he did? Oh. How could that be? Dad said there wasn't a mark on Gregory's body. His heart just gave out. Find anything interesting. Oh, this is getting... I, I can't make sense of it yet. It's just getting good. Oh my gosh. So hey, this is weird. Yeah, I tried to warn you. Yeah, sort of. I'll explain everything if we survive long enough. Those certainly look threatening. Huh. Statues. The guardians of Pharaoh's domain. Hmm. Oh shit. Uh-oh. Those aren't statues. Look out! Get the CO out of here. This is just us then. A bunch of cowards. Oh, no. The dynamic duo. I like those cowards up there. Got some good loot too. Shit. I'll go ahead and medicine pouch is full. Thanks. Where's Overseer Bohai? He has decided to return to the surface. A wise choice. We can't afford to lose any more divine than necessary. Wonder if we killed him. So, no more delays. We must proceed.
Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. And looking up at the giant, hideous statue of Ted in the Great Hall. At his eyes. And I know now that he's watching me. He's watching us all. He's always had power over us. I just never knew how much. Did you discover some data? A fragment. A, a testament to Ted's power. Ah. I wonder if he killed the girl, too. Hmm. Oh, shoot. Ever deeper we go. Throne attached to some kind of apparatus. He's gonna get trapped in there. I wonder what it does. Watch him go sit at, uh, on it and then he gets trapped. An impressive dude. setup. What is it for? I'm sorry, Theo. I don't know. My focus can't read the data here. What about the living ancestor? Is the data lost to her? Let's read this. Hear the song. Ted's getting impatience. How can I explain to him that you cannot really prove an organism has achieved immortality in a day, a week, or even a year? The question literally embodies an idiom. Only time will tell. I have no idea how long his body will survive. All I know is that it will last a lot longer than mine. As far as the therapy goes, we've graduated from two steps forward, one step back to two steps forward, one step sideways with each treatment. His cells regenerate more effectively at this point. I don't think they're aging at all, but mutations keep popping up and each one has been treated individually. So far, my strategy has a pharmaceutical whack-a-mole seems to be working, but for how long and what's uh, with what side effects? The irony is I probably achieved more for the field in these last two years than the entire industry did in the last 20, but no one's around to appreciate it. Ted sure doesn't. These days, he doesn't seem to appreciate anything. Hmm. What's going on with Ted? I never thought Ted would actually do it. I assumed the whole thing was just to scare me. Keep me under control to show me that he might do. To show me what he might do to Kanya if I stepped out of the line and screwed up his treatment. It certainly kept me motivated. What does it say about me, about us? There's so few of us left. And we're uh, still keeping secrets from each other. Such terrible secrets. Oh, shit. Man, that was crazy, dude. Scan the device, if you will. I'm gonna have to wait, dude. Seriously? Fuck up. Or put an arrow in your face. Asshole. You did this for him? You Please. put, like, Scan the all device. switches in everyone's heads? Kenya, you? you mustn't judge me. I had no choice. If I said no, what would he do to us? What would he do to you? You're my little girl. Wow. I was trying to keep you alive. Tell me what your focus what, reveals Dad? about the device. Seriously, why? So we can be trapped in this underground nightmare? You know what we have to do. Please. Did you find a recording, Aloy? Yeah. So her dad was a, uh, a doctor for I'll science. With you. Doctor Scan slash the scientist. device, if you will. But Ted, what are you doing? Patient seeing. Made a minor adjustment to the gene therapy regimen and added a new cocktail to treat the symptoms caused by the mutations. Hopefully. There will be some stabilization after the next treatment. 
God knows what Ted will do to us if there isn't. The early results were so promising. No signs of aging, no cellular degeneration, but now... Oh, if only I had access to my old lab in Bangkok, or my old colleagues, or my old liquor cabinet. What? Stop it. Got to stay positive. For Kenya. You saw something. I could tell. Did the data explain what Pharaoh used this device for? Uh -oh. I think he was undergoing treatments to live longer. A lot longer. Really? Could he still be alive? Don't be foolish. If he were alive, he would have kept his essence. It would not have been passed down to me. Remember, <laughs> he was the renewer. Of course he would have stopped at nothing to grasp the secrets of life and death. But not for himself. Everything he did was for a new beginning. For us, for the Quen. And for his true heir, me. This idiot's gonna get stuck on that shit. You know, I'm starting to think you're right. You do have a lot in common with Ted Farrow. I knew you would see in time. Let us continue. His secrets await. Oh, he, didn't, he, didn't, he didn't take a shot at it. I thought he would sit there and then get injected with some shit and hmm. die. Is that a small office? For a minor functionary, perhaps? All this equipment. We are getting closer to the heart of this place. I can feel it. An automated geothermal energy plant right under the city of San Francisco. A marvel. Even I can run it. And let's face it, I was always more of a visionary than an engineer. Which is why I had the foresight to insist on the inclusion of a very unique feature. Just in case anyone ever tries to steal my cheese, so to speak. The door down. I'm going to look for another way in. Good idea. It's worked before. Very well. Get to it. And this is where we came from? Yes. Ass up, man. This guy's annoying. Ah, is that a vent of some sort? No, Not a bad idea. It's your mama's ass. Quite loose indeed. Oh wow, look at this. She's gone. Did she make it to the other <laughs> side? I'm gonna investigate all of this before I open up the door to this dork. This guy talks so much. Our console. Maybe I can access Ted's files from here. There's so much loot in this place. I wonder if we're gonna go up against the boss or what, because there is a lot, a lot of loot in this place. What sort of boss fight would seem adequate right now. Life. And this is how they repaid me by leaving me all alone. 
Whoa. But I guess I've been alone since this whole thing began. Alone in bearing the burden for the past, for the future. Same old Ted. No matter who dies, he's the one feeling sorry for himself. Less his future. Less his children. Someday they'll come, and I'll be here to greet them. Sometimes that my aging has stopped altogether. If anything, my cells are replenishing faster than normal. I just need some time for the mutations to calm down. Yo. Time. And energy. Sometimes if the reactor can give me what I need to grow strong again, to get my shit back together, so I can greet the kids. They're gonna need me. My advice. My guidance. And then I won't be alone anymore. Uh-oh. Pharaoh's secrets. Are they here? Uh, not the ones you're looking for. Then they must be in there. Oh my gosh. Trust me. You don't want to go in there. Are you mad? I haven't come all this way to stop now. Legacy is mine. Is that it's him? Burn it to ash. Wait, no. Pharaoh has it rigged to melt down if... Kill them too. No witnesses. What the fuck? I gave you target! Look at this piece of shit, what the fuck? Are you okay? Do 
douchebag. He's gonna kill himself. Oh, he's gonna die. I'm gonna save himself. Better yet. There he goes. Yo, by the head itself. <laughs> by the head itself. Oh my god. Time for us to get the heck out of here. Um. I'm guessing through here. We found something that will help. Not just your homeland, but everywhere. But where's the CO? Oh, he's... gone. I guess you could say he gave his life to help us attain the secrets of Thebes. I see. You must think I'm eminently stupid. What? No. No. The CEO was an entitled egotist who twisted our beliefs into a sickening, self-serving fantasy. And you expect me to believe he sacrificed himself for scraps of data? It's time for the truth, and it better be convincing. Otherwise, I'll simply order these soldiers to open hmm. fire. Hold on. You're right. To be honest, the CO screwed everything up. He brought Thebes down around our ears and died like a gutless coward. But we really did find something down there that will help your homeland. If I can take it and use it. Now, if I have to, I will fight my way out of here, but it doesn't have to be that way. You can just let me go. And then take credit when things start to improve. <laughs> Success certainly does sound better than failure. It seems then that our destinies are intertwined. Landfall is open to you. If it will help your cause, you may come and go as you please, but Alva must join you and report back on your efforts. Cool. Fair All enough. Right. Thebes is of no further value to us. Obviously, we're going back to the flotilla. Alva, I expect your reports to be thorough. Oh, I thought he was going to have us killed. Oh, and instead, I get to join you. Glad to have you. <laughs> but you're going to need a little help to reach our base. Varl, I made a new friend. I need you to meet her at the Quen Ferry and escort her back. On it. Can't wait to meet her. 
Trust me, you'll love it there. Varl will give you a better focus and all the data you could ever want. Head to the ferry. I'll join you back east as soon as I can. A diviner must follow the truth, wherever it leads. I'll see you there. Now that I have Omega Clearance, we should have what we need to capture Hephaestus. But before I head to the ferry, maybe I should stop by Landfall. With the CO gone, maybe more Quen will be willing to talk. Might be worth looking around the island, too. I gotta change out of these clothes. I can't believe the CO made me play dress up. Wow, dude. What a freaking episode. Holy smokes. <sighs> Alright, guys. So we're gonna end it here. This has been a phenomenal episode. Thank you guys for watching. If you'd like to see more Horizon Forbidden West here on the channel, drop it a like. These episodes are taking a little while, I know, but I'm trying to get them out at 4K and long. I, I don't know. I'm going to try and get this one up today as well. But anyways, thank you again. Phenomenal, phenomenal story. I love this game so much. And I hope you guys are enjoying it indeed. So, again, if you did, drop it a like. And I will catch you on the next one.